Uh, right. <laughs> so, hi guys, first of all. Yeah. Um, first of all, I'd like to apologise for being so inactive over the past month or so, because I know I haven't been pumping out um, videos as often as I like. Um, I would like to be pumping them out a lot more. Uh, and I apologise even more so for the past few days, because I haven't been in the best... Um, free my mind, let's leave it at that. Um, a lot's gone on. Um, so, I'm not going to get into that. Uh, but I do have some things I'd like to show you. Ooh, sorry for blinding you. Now. Um, I do have a couple of new purchases I'd like to show you. Or projects, whatever you want to call them. Stay! Right, you can see the necessary parts of... Anyway, you can see. Um, so basically, uh, I've been eyeing these up for a while, uh, thinking about respraying them. So um, I'm going to start with. It's only two, so I wouldn't get too. Uh, I'm overhyped. Uh, I hope you enjoyed my last video, which was Lucille. Uh, excuse me. Um, as you can see, this is um, a uh, Nerf gun. Um, and, as you can see, it's, um, quite orange, <laughs> apart from, like, this part, the, um, ammo thing there, which I press that in and it just slides out like a revolver sort of, um, thing. They're quite powerful, but, um, no, what I wanted to show, tell you about these is that, um, I'm going to be respraying them. This one, I'm not sure yet, I'm thinking of going for a Destiny gun. Uh, I'm thinking of doing like the colour scheme of a gun from Destiny. I've asked for suggestions. If you have any suggestions, if you play Destiny, please do put them in the comments below. Uh, and I will try and get round to looking at them. But as you can see, it's a good looking gun. It's a nice gun. I do enjoy it. I do like it a lot. Um, but anyway, that's the first one. And the second one, uh, I've been wanting for quite a while. And I finally do have it. And it is this. You guys probably recognise this. Um, this is the First Order Stormtrooper Nerf Blaster. Uh, I do have ammo in the clip at the, clip at the moment, but I don't have the um, camera at the right angle to show you uh, what the firing range is like. Um, but um, I am going to be respraining this one as well. Um, I'm very happy with this one. I really like it, like because of like the size is good. Um, it's a good blaster, I like it. Um, if I push down this little orange thing here, I'm not sure if you can see that. Uh, push that down and the stock comes off so I can make it a little more. To me, that looks more like a, um E11 blaster, the Imperial blaster. Um, but no, um, that just I just literally pushed that back on. The um, scope also comes off, so now it looks more... I'm not sure. Uh, but, um, yeah, the scope also looks pretty cool on the other Nerf Blaster, as, um, I will show you right now, um, if I just clip them on there, it looks pretty nice, I do like the scope on that one, um, but as you can see, it's a quite nice scope, uh, and it's interchangeable, which is also a very, um, good thing, yes, the time is still going, just gotta check, um, but, no, I am very happy with this one, um, the, to get the ammo clip out, you do just press in the orange thing and pull. Um, I don't, it, see, you can't see in there, like in here. But, um, the way it does is, is you pull this back and then it loads the next clip into that next um, nerf dart in there. But um, as you see, the clip is very basic. It's made to, it's white because it's made to look like the. Uh, I'm not sure what uh, E11D. I can't remember the name of this rifle. Um, but it's made to look as most as close to the um, uh, 